Welcome back into After the Whistle. There are still more teams who are on their way to the B, starting with a team who punched their ticket in the same place they'll play next week. Yeah, that's right. Region 6, always fun. And it's a team that's no stranger to state. The Rugby Panthers, a basketball-heavy school, making their return for the first time since 2020 to the state tournament after taking down our Redeemers 48-41 in the Region 6 title game. Rugby was the last Region 6 team to reach the state title game where they fell by just two points to Kindred back in 2019. After missing the state tournament the last few seasons, the team is ready to show what they're made of at the state tournament once again with the roster featuring nine seniors led by Region 6 Coach of the Year, Jen Brosser. I couldn't be proud of these girls, but we're not done. Uh, we got a lot of unfinished business. Um, last couple years, it's been a little tough watching someone else go. Well-deserved teams that went and represented, though, and uh, we're just glad to be back. I feel like our chemistry within the team, we have such great chemistry. Like I said, we've been playing together since fifth grade, and we just have such great chemistry all together, and we bond together so well, and we just love each other, and we get along. Well, while the Panthers scored 63 points per game in the regular season, the team hangs their hat on what they bring defensively, giving just over 38 points a game heading into the postseason. The team's defensive effort in the region championship is a big reason why they're headed back to state. These girls, I don't know if they admit it, but they like to play defense. Um, it's a heck of a ball team. Senior stepped up, made some great stops. Uh, Peyton Hogg played a phenomenal basketball game. Jordan Junt, Joey Wolf had some great shots under the basket. Um, I could go on and on, but that was a collective effort by 15 girls that didn't want to quit their season. We play defense so intense. We love to play defense. I feel like that's kind of our backbone. Obviously, that gets our offense flowing, and we just we just love to play. We play it so intense. We always are just going on defense. We just love to play it. Here's the Panthers tournament profile. Rugby won its first 14 games of the season before the Panthers lost in two of their last four games of the season by seven points at home to Shiloh Christian and at Thompson. Entering the postseason as the top seed in District 11, they beat West Hope Newburgh and Botno to take the District 11 title, following that with wins over TGU and South Prairie Max to get back in the regional title game. The Panthers trying to become the first Region 6 team to win the title since Bishop Ryan won its third straight in 2016. Take a look at our player to watch for the Panthers has got to be the senior forward by Kale Heidelbaum. With more than 1,000 career points and multiple all-district and all-region awards under her belt, she signed on to play college ball in Northern State in the NSIC next season. This is her third trip to the state tournament. She was on that 2019 team as an eighth grader, so she knows what it takes to win games on the state stage.